Well, today we got a special treat for you guys. We got the Hack 5 Wi-Fi Pineapple Pager, and I really didn't feel like shelling out 300 bucks to get this device. So I took a trip down to Valley Tech Custom Solutions so we can get a live demonstration for you. Now, I want to start off by saying that it is not a replacement for the Flipper Zero or the Kisu or the LilyGo TM bed. It's a pen testing tool for Wi-Fi only. So don't get this just because it's the hottest new item by Hack5 or because it's the pager. Like I wish we had more devices in the shape of a pager, but we don't have that. So we're gonna be going over the user interface and some more of the features that this device can do. Now, the first thing you're gonna notice is there's no SD card slot, but with it having four gigabytes of EMMC, that's not gonna be an issue. Now, as for the desktop, you can see we have alerts, payloads, recon, pineapple, and settings, if we go into settings, you can see we can control the volume, the brightness, the normal things that you can do with settings. Uh, you can see the network management, and we can see this thing has Bluetooth, 2.4 gigahertz, 5 gigahertz, and 6 gigahertz Wi-Fi. And one thing I wanted to point out, if you go over to the system part of the settings, you can add a pin code, and they have the whole pin setup process to add a whole nother layer of security to the device. The Pine app allows you to control your pineapple access points and see your list of client IDs. The Recon app allows you to monitor packet data and see your list of access points. And the Alerts section allows you to see all the data you capture while using your device. Now, being an active member of the war driving community, I am really excited for the tri-band Wi-Fi, and I wish this device came with an internal GPS. Hack5 does sell one on their website, but you can pick up a cheaper version for a fraction of the price. Now, I've been playing with this device for about an hour and a half, and although I fully don't understand how to use it, I am really excited to see what the Hack5 team is ready to come up with next. 